Welcome to Wednesday with Weingarts. I'm Ron Weingarts. Today I'm here to talk about two models of Billy Goat aerators. Let me start with the model AE403. So this is more of a conventional uh, uh, roller uh, drum type, type aerator. Uh, what's kind of unique about this is first off you drive the front tires so for loading up and down trailers you don't have a big poly drum. Uh, works uh, exceptionally well. And also for a counterbalance of weight uh, you got a water tank with a nice gauge, so at full, uh, full of water you're at 50 pounds versus having metal weights that are kind of clunky and make a lot of noise and um, kind of rattle around. So that's a, that's a really nice feature and also uh, it's got a nice easy drain so when you're not using it um, to move it around you're taking that weight off. Also they've done a nice job with the levers to drop your tines in you just drop this down. Uh, but anybody that's used an aerator knows you got a lot of back and forth this is get very easy. They've done a great job at the leverage point to make it very easy to pull it in and out, in and out of the ground. So it's a very simple design. The clutch to engage your tines and drive uh, uh, is right here. You disengage, just release. So it's very simple, but a very well-built product. And this, uh, as with all types of, of, of uh, rolling type aerators, does a great job um, in most conditions um, you know, naturally, you know, the more weight you have, uh, if you're in a little harder conditions to help push those tines into the ground. But it does a great job uh, and is very fast and efficient. So if you're looking for kind of a simple um, yet productive aerator, this is a great, great option and will give you years of, years of great service. Let me move on over to the plugger. So if you're doing a lot of uh, uh, aerating and looking at really production style aeration um, this moves up this the the standard aerator is a 21 this is a 25 inch um, and it has hydro drive so you get more flexibility of your ground your ground speed depending on the conditions um, and also this is a reciprocating uh, aerator so reciprocator you're basically pushing the tines into the ground so if you get into those hard soils uh, you can still move at a fairly good rate of speed, but it's going to get those tines down that two and three quarter inches that is optimal for, for best, um, uh, best aeration performance. Uh, very intuitive controls. They have a hand lever to drop your tines uh, into the ground. When you want to raise your tines, you just push on the pedal and that'll pop them up out of the ground. So it's very quick, quick and easy. You have forward and reverse letter, levers for your hydro. So there again, this is going to be a lot easier on the operator with the hydro. You know, this is your speed control and forward and reverse. So if you're working on the smaller lawns, even though it's a little bigger machine, uh, you're still going to you know, be able to maneuver. Um, and they do have front caster wheels, so it gives you an uh, easy pivot point to move back and, back and forth. So it's really a higher production, uh, higher quality aerator with the reciprocating type, type drive. So for production aerating, uh, if you want a high productive aerator but don't want a big uh, clumsy machine, uh, the, the Billy Goat Plugger is definitely something to take a good, good hard look at. Thanks for listening today. Wine guards, wine guards, everything.